hi guys welcome back to my channel um so in this video i'm going to show you a quick tip how to save a whole lot of data and space on your phone if you're a youtuber so starting out on youtube i used to just edit my videos and upload it and that used to cost me a whole lot of data until i discovered this app which saves me a whole lot of space and a whole lot of data so the app basically compresses your video size and retains the file quality so you don't lose any quality in the video in the video you don't lose any video quality and you get your video exported in a lesser file size so the app i use is video compressor panda the app name is video compressor of panda and it's free to use you can export as many videos as you want and compress their files so this is i'm just going to show you how to walk through a walkthrough of it so this is the video i am editing for my youtube one a video i'm going to i'm about posting so i've i'm done editing it and the file size is about 200 mb over, a little over 200 mb so i'm going to try to compress it so i'll select the video you can select multiple videos by tapping on them i'm just going to leave it at one so another quick another way you can leverage on this you can edit multiple videos for your youtube and just compress them at a go so i'm just going to do this for one video for the purpose of this tutorial so i'm going to select it you can see one selected and the file size is 209 mb if i select another one it will increase to 500 and something maybe so i'm just going to click on next after you are done selecting your videos um, i'm going to select the video and it will prompt you to select the size you can just compress it to but you can compress it using this low resolution but this one will reduce the video quality of your video you can set it to medium and it will come out better but in a lower quality then this large file it will just compress it and maintain your aspect ratio if you exported your video in 4k ratio it can it will export it in that same 4k ratio while reducing the size so there are other ways you can select so this is the one for 4k so you can select a custom dimension but i'm just going to leave it at a large file so it will just compress using the aspect ratio you used during your editing so once you're done selecting your aspect ratio you just click on this compress and i will have to warn you this takes a whole lot of time so you can just leave it to be exporting and you go about your daily routine so i'm going to pause this video and take it back after it is done compressing so roughly it will take about 15 to 20 minutes to compress it might be lesser depending on your device so i'm just going to pause this video and pick it up after it is done compressing <coughs> so this is the final version of the video after the compression has been done you can see from the comparison that the original size was 209 mb and it was compressed to 24 mb while retaining the aspect ratio and the quality of the video so after this is done you can just click on this save icon to save it to your device and you can have your video in lesser in a lesser file size with the same quality as the, that with the greater size so this is what i'm using for my youtube videos it saves me a whole lot of a whole lot of data and i think everyone needs to give it a try so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye for now